was, I was going to ask if you had seen the uh, the new the Rolling Stones documentary, the Crossfire Hurricane. I have not seen it yet. Is it good? It is good. It was it was quite good. There were there were some things in there that that were kind of surprising. Mm-hmm. Um, and they were talking about you know right in the in the beginning when they would you know in the early '60s there um, when they would play shows and you know there would be the girls screaming and losing their minds and and fainting all this I knew about, but they also said that oftentimes they would completely lose control of their bodies and all of them would, would pee their pants, which I thought That's was... horrifying. Horrifying. They lose control right. of their bodies. <laughs> it was such a weird thing. I mean, the, and, and you watch So that's how it is now. Like, like, if they play they now, they're exactly. in the same boat. Isn't that ironic? They've come full circle. Now they're just incontinent because yeah. they're old. Now the Rolling Stones are on stage, and they and, and once again they do not have control over their bodies. <laughs> right? Where are they going to get that tour? Uh, the, it's sponsored by uh, uh, Depends, like that right. one that Lisa Renna wore. Mm-hmm. How much money? Look, did you see this commercial? You know who Lisa Renna is. No. Is that her name, Lisa Renna? Right? And she um. She she's married to Harry Hamlin. You know who that is Clash of the Titans. Remember? Yeah. Um. She's married to this dude, and she's like on a reality show. She was I forget what what she's famous from. I don't remember. But um, she did this commercial. Now I have to find. Now I have to find it. I have to find it now. This commercial. Hey. Wait till you hear this, Angela. You're not gonna. Okay. You're gonna flip your wig when you hear this thing. Yeah, I'd say I type in Lisa Renna. First thing that comes up on YouTube depends. Like that's sad. That's what she's known for. Hold on. Wait till you hear this. Where's this commercial? Here it is. Okay. Two, four, six, eight. Got to bring that channel up. Set that over there. Let's see if this works. America to get people to try on these new Depend Silhouette briefs, and today we're rocking the red carpet. Look, it's Lisa Rinna. Lisa, hi. I know you don't need one, but will you try on these new Depend Silhouette briefs for charity and prove just how great the fit is, even under a fantastic dress? Are you serious? I am serious. Sure. Why not? She's doing it. The best protection now looks, fits, and feels just like underwear. Hey, Lisa, who are you wearing? She's wearing the new Depend Silhouette. We invite you to get it for... Unbelievable. Like they had to put in, I know you don't need these. I know you don't need these, but uh, would you rock these Depends? Is that really where we're at now? This collision of generations all stacked on top of each other? Man, it might be time to go back to people dying at 30. The 30 might be time for old age again. Mm. Might be time, right? Yeah. Contagion time, right? Bring on the plague. <laughs> I saw a bird dead in the street the other day. I thought it was like contagion. Yee. Dead pigeon just laying there. That's gross. Did you see contagion, Mike? I saw it in IMAX. I saw it on a cruise. You saw it on a cruise? Oh, that's, that's right. a terrible place to watch contagion. Yeah. Well, what's next? You're going to watch Flight on a Plane? Yeah. <laughs> it's like... Who the picked? most likely to come true to fruition is on a cruise. But look at this. This is Lisa Renna. Going back to Lisa Renna. We know you don't need these Depends. And they say it's for charity. I'll tell you one thing. Look, I'm a charitable person. As evidenced by... Your fundraising. My, my fundraising. Thank you, Angela. You're welcome. But I'm telling you this. There's no amount of money... That I would do a commercial where I had to rock depends. Like, Tom, you can fix everything. Everything. We're telling you, we have enough money behind this. Everything will be fixed. Like every like sick people, yes, that will be fixed. Hungry, yes, fixed. All you have to do is go on this thing and rock. wear some depends. Well, I wish I could help everyone out, <laughs> but life is tough sometimes. Of course you'd do it. You're probably doing it right now. Weirdo. I would do it. Mike's probably doing it for kicks. So he just doesn't have to get up. 
Sloth. You know what I mean? Sloth. Yeah. Depends for. Depends silhouette for women. Silhouette. Silhouette. That's the brand. That, what, what is that implying? That there's there's no uh, diaper panty line? Or? Well, yes, of course. She's she can be on the red carpet, and no one would know that she's wearing a. I don't want to talk about this anymore. I'm sorry. Thanks for calling. Cause yeah, this Rolling Stones thing. De- depends silhouette. It'd be like ban and out. Depends silhouette. Ban and out. If you stop me up, right? Hello? Diaper, diaper rock. Then the new Rolling Stone song, like somebody is, sent me something, uh, and they said like in it, I gotta look at the lyrics for this song. It was crazy the stuff they were mentioning. I think they mentioned it was like singing about Groupons or something, like so dated. Like what's that song called? Rolling Stone's new song. Doom and Gloom, it's called. And that album cover, congratulations, Rolling Stones. You had a lot of bad album covers. You, t- you finally came up with the worst one. A gorilla with that logo. With the, 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 the mouth, the tongue logo. Yeah, where is this lyric? Let's see. I had a dream last night that I was piloting a plane. And all the passengers were drunk and insane. I crash landed in a Louisiana swamp. What is this? This is a... I crash landed in a Louisiana swamp. Shot up a horde of zombies. So you guess... Can we all be done with zombies now at this point too? Zombies. Oh brother. That show Walking Dead. I watched one season that thing. You couldn't pay me to watch more of that. They're running from the same thing every week. Zombies. Same zombies. I shot up a horde of zombies, but I come out on top. What's it all about? It just reflects my mood. I like giving it this completely disrespectful read. Sitting in the dirt, feeling kind of hurt. All I hear is doom and gloom. And all is darkness in my room. I'm reading it like a kid reading, like a poem in, like, eighth grade. And all is darkness in my room. Through the light, your face I see. Baby, take a chance. Baby, won't you dance with me? Lost all that treasure in an overseas war. It just goes to show you don't get what you paid for. Battle to the rich. What's this guy mention, rich? How dare you? Don't mention the struggle anymore. This guy. You're not you're not a street fighting man. No, you're looking down on the street fighting man from uh, Trump Towers. Battle to the rich and you worry about the poor. Put my feet on the couch and lock all the doors. Hear a funky noise. That's the tightening of the screws. I'm feeling kind of hurt sitting in the dirt. Okay, I'm not going to read that. That's apparently the course. Oh, here it is. Fracking deep for oil. Fracking, this guy mentions in the thing. Fracking deep for oil, but there's nothing in the sump. There's all there's kids all picking at the garbage dump. I'm r- and there's the beer. Mike just great. Look, you know what, Mike? I'll you made the right call on that one. You can you bring one in for me? <laughs> I can't do this. There's like I would I would crack a beer open too if you're hearing these lyrics. Fracking deep for oil, but there's nothing in the sump. There's kids all picking at the garbage dump. I'm running out of water, so I better prime the pump. I'm trying to stay so stay sober, but I end up drunk. We'll be eating dirt. Living on the side of the road. There's some food for thought. Kind of makes your head explode. Feeling kind of hurt. Yeah. Unbelievable. Oh, boy. The lyrics. That's crazy. It's personal. You can tell it's a very personal. Oh, it's a very personal song. 
Sounds like he, th- he threw darts at a, an issue of USA Today, and like whatever words he hit made it into the song. Who's good here, Mike? Two. Two? Best show, you're on the air. Hello, oh, Sopling. Okay. 